Hey, listen, I have a surprise for you. Oh, you do? Yeah, dog. Like, Come I, down later for yeah, moose soup. She's the best. Yeah. Ah! Hey, so, I man, I've been waiting to share this with you. For is like, this a surprise thing that's in here? This is a surprise video, bro. Okay. I've been waiting to share this with you for so long, just weeks. Like, you were in, you were in Australia when this happened. Okay. And you were the first person I thought of. I have not seen this. Oh, no. No, you have not. <laughs> Should I click it? Just let's go. Let's fucking the let's video, dive right? in, dude. So this, is, this is from my podcast, Where My Mom's At. Okay. Ali Makovsky was the guest. Okay. And we learned something very troubling about Ali Makovsky. Okay. Go ahead. She's a very funny comedian. I pick yeah. my nose. Sometimes I eat my boogers. That's what I mean. You yeah. eat them still? I do, yeah. You eat them still? Yeah. This is a WMMA exclusive. Go ahead and mark this. Hold on. We got to talk about this. It's this not is just like every once in a while. It's like any time I pick my nose, I eat my boogers. Okay. I like it. No, They're it, yummy. That's okay. And I've talked about this before on other podcasts, but... Where, where everyone goes oh you just gotta flick it okay so now my boogers are just on the, under the table on the chair it's disgusting i'm putting it back in where it belongs yeah if i feel a booger i simply grab it i examine it and i decide hey what's the best and usually it's just put it in your mouth and get rid of the problem is it the taste or the consistency at this point i don't even <laughs> know if i like love it it's just so easy you're just used to it i'm used to it yeah but i do and i do enjoy it For those just listening, my husband just dry heaved and he's totally red and you look like you really have tears in your eyes like you're going to vomit. And I know how much this upsets you and this is making me so happy right now. <laughs> this is payback for all the puke videos. Ah! Is that what the surprise was? That you knew it was going to make me feel sick? Yeah. You did? Yeah. Every time we talk about eating boogers, that's how you react. Okay. Uh, kudos. Good, good job. Well, how do you feel? Tell me. I feel me. sick to my stomach. What do you mean? How do I feel? And it's not because, I hope you know, for Ali, it's not because it's you, Ali. It's just that topic has always, I don't know, I have this reaction to it. I always have. Have you tried eating your boogers? Fuck no. <laughs> not even as a kid? No. You never just gave them? No. Never. Yeah. I mean, I've, I had, like I've had like anybody uh, snot. You yeah, know, it's not drip the into same. my mouth yeah. or like, uh, you know, something drips into your, like, but like actually made the conscious effort to do that. Never. Right. I Never. used to be a uh, avid nose picker and eater when I was a child. I've told a story on the podcast at some point before too, that when I was in, God, it was third grade. I think it was thir third grade. You know, old school people t that are young now don't know this, but there really wasn't a big emphasis on seat belts um, for a long time in this country. <laughs> yeah, no. And we would be in the back of a station wagon. You have to look that up too. And no seat belts, no nothing. And we're in the back of this thing. Uh, myself, Brian, you know, probably one of my sisters, just fucking around going somewhere. You know, we're kids. We're like seven, eight, eight years old, eight, nine years old. And we have pulled up to a stoplight. And at the stoplight, we have a, a, a minivan pulls up behind us and I know uh, the lady driving, it's Mrs. Obzarski. And I'm in school with her son, Steve. And I, we go, oh, look who it is. And we start waving. Mm -hmm. We don't realize that, that I guess there's a, some reflective tint on the back of the station wagon. So she doesn't see us, but we keep, we're like trying to wave and get her. And she's sitting there and I, I, mean, I remember like it was yesterday. We see her pick her nose. We're like, oh my gosh, she's picking her nose. And then she looks and then she puts it in her mouth. And we were like, I just was like floored. Now that, I don't remember making me nauseous, but the older I've gotten, the more nauseating it is to me. I don't know why. It's a, it's not like a, I mean, it is, I guess, a judgment, but it is happening on a deeper level right. to me. It's it's the way I feel about vomiting. Like you you get yeah. you get physically reactive. I get super so reactive, yeah. Do you know, by the way, we had a revelation on this episode as well yeah. of where my mom's at that you know who else picks and eats? God, fuck. Do you know who else? Who? Your co host of Two Bears, Bert Krishner. That I've heard before. Luckily, I never see it. And we don't talk about it. So we don't talk about it. You need to bring this up, Tom. Look, there's guy. There's like guy's got a lot of problems. I don't think I need to <laughs> focus on nose picking with him. Yeah, because Ali was like, "Yeah, you know who else is Bert?" Bert Do they does talk it. about it. Uh -huh. 
I yeah, it is something that I find absolutely physically repulsive. Yeah, I can't even. I don't know. And I'm not like not gross. I'm sure there's things that you could. It's not like I'm just super. You just burped on the mic. Yeah. By the way. Right. I haven't done that in like two episodes. <laughs> There's not there's there's certainly things about me that they'd probably hear and be like that's even grosser I don't know, but that one in particular has always done something to me. Yeah. Eating bugs. Uh huh. I mean, look, I don't mean to shame her or or anybody in the booger. I know me neither. Community, but I, just, I think yeah. it's fine, and I get it. Like when I was a little girl, I really loved doing it. Oh man, you find I like really a, wish we would move a on. good scraggler with like a crunch on the end of it, and I remember the time I stopped though. My dad, I was in the back of my back seat of my Dirty dad's bitch. I was in the back seat of my dad's car doing it. And he was like, You gotta knock that off. You gotta knock that off. Otherwise the wicked witch is gonna take away your your nose, your finger. And I was like, Oh really? shit. Yeah, I did. he stopped me from doing that stuff. God, it's so repulsive. Ooh, mommy, did you enjoy that highlight? Why don't you have more fun? Click around. Click here. We're here. We're here. We're here. We're here. Look. Try it out. Have more fun. Why don't you subscribe? That way, every time a video drops, you can be notified. You're not going to miss a moment of denim, okay? Try it out. Be her.